Hi, this is Neil of Team Teacher, teaching, living, and raising a family in China. Today, we are going to look at blocked websites in China. Let's check it out. What do I mean by blocked websites? Well, basically, that's it. These are websites that are blocked. You cannot gain access to them in China. And this is because China has uh, a degree of censorship and what is often referred to as the great Chinese firewall which prevents using uh, these websites apps or programs that uh, don't conform with chinese law or regulations basically google play store doesn't work in china so it's difficult to get apps uh, without a vpn and uh, that is the big one that many people have problems with. You could download a uh, Chinese app store from Xiaomi, Huawei, or the QQ Tencent uh, app store. Some blocked social media would be Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, Tumblr, Snapchat, a lot of the blogs like Blogspot, Blogger, WordPress, SoundCloud, Google+, Plus, Google Han uh, Hangouts, uh, Hootsuite even as well. Uh, instead of using this uh, Western social media, what you can do is you can actually use some of the Chinese social media. So uh, there's Weixin, WeChat, which is like Chinese Facebook. Uh, Twitter would be Weibo. Uh, Instagram would be something like Douyin, uh, TikTok, or MyPie. Uh, also, there's QQ as well. Also, apps like WhatsApp, uh, Telegram, Line, Periscope, uh, Kakao Talk. These apps you cannot use without a VPN. Search engines. Google is completely blocked. Um, Google.com, .hk, .whatever country you're in, all blocked. Uh, Bing and Yahoo aren't. They do have their own Chinese versions that work okay. And DuckDuckGo is also out as well. For Chinese versions of search engines, you could try Baidu, which is the Google equivalent here, or Sogu. Video sharing, uh, there's no YouTube, no Vimo, no Daily Motion. Uh, for music, there's no Spotify, Pandora. For entertainment, there's no Netflix, Hulu, Amazon Video. These are all out. Instead, for Chinese versions, you can use Youku, which is Chinese YouTube um, entertainment. There's IQIYI and QQ Tencent Video. For music, you can try QQ Music, uh, which is the most popular one here. News media has even more uh, block sites New York Times, Financial Times, Wall Street Journal, The Economist, Bloomberg, Reuters, Independent, uh, Le Monde, Google News, many of the Wikipedia pages are all blocked. Uh, BBC, uh, you generally can actually gain access to and it's not actually that censored, which is fine. In addition, you can try uh, local news platforms like China Daily, China Wire, uh, Sixth Tone, and there's also the that series which have for different local cities and other local media outlets as well that can kind of keep you up to date with what's happening in china and a little bit of out work tools google drive dropbox google docs uh, gmail uh, google calendar you've seen a theme here uh, shutterstock slideshare uh, Slack, iStock Photos, uh, Wayback Machine, Script, uh, Xing, Android. Many of these sites uh, and work tools that you would normally use are restricted 
or if they're not restricted, run very, very slow. Uh, instead of Google Drive, uh, you could try using Baidu Cloud, Baidu Pan, I think it might be called. Also, um, the OneDrive uh, that is attached to Outlook seems to work okay as well. Well, that was a big uh, list of all the block sites, apps, tools, outlets uh, that are you can access in China. Obviously, that's going to change. Um, maybe more will added, maybe some will get allowed if they cooperate with the Chinese uh, government and their laws and regulations. But for now, uh, if you want to gain access to those that we've mentioned, you're going to need a VPN. Uh, the one that we recommend we'll put in a link below uh, so you can gain access to that. Also consider trying out those Chinese um, equivalents that we mentioned during the video and we've put links below on how you can actually download and use those um, Chinese equivalents as well. I hope you found this video uh, informative and you enjoyed the video. If you did, please consider liking and subscribing to our channel. Bye bye.